And before you start guys, remember in the video description you find all the unlawed links and a tons and other different cool tutorials for Touch Reboards. Let's get started. That go and collect resources, at least 5 pieces of plank, 20 lead uh, ingot, 6 redstone dust, furnace, 6 sub, how to obtain sub I show in previous video because it is a very important material for this mod and 3 copper ingot and any type of pickaxe because you know, ah, and fuel for your furnace. Then place a furnace and furnace a place sub and sub become rubber. After that, first red type, uh, you need this thing uh, isolated copper cable, six pieces in this red type, three pieces of uh, red cal battery, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, then combine and create battery box. After you place battery box in the, somewhere in the world, you cannot uh, collect the stuff with PKX. Now, forget about that. Uh, create range with this red type, then press and hold shift, press right mouse button, collect battery box. box. Now, very important, by default, all side of this uh, thing, it is always input, except this C side, C, this dot. This uh, side work as output. How system work? Uh, for example, it is work as battery. I won't put the uh, energy here. For that, use any type of energy source, for example, generator. And after that, use any type of cable, the cheapest one, for example, copper, because uh, this thing work with energy of 32 uh, energy per tick. So it is very low rate, bel believe me. For example, the cheapest copper cable transfer rate 128 energy per tick. Then, do like so. Connect your energy source with your battery box and you put energy here. Now, remember, if you are uh, the left so slot, it is always for charge your item, for example, industrial drill. See, it is very, very work very slow because it is chief uh, thing for the beginning of the game. So, use this? No, because cheap. And then, if you want discharge item, place this item in right slot. Like so. I not know why, but you cannot discharge industrial drill, for example. Only battery. Why? I not. Now, here we have two configuration. The easiest one, it is the redstone configuration. How it is work? By default, uh, it is no... Uh, Ignore any type of redstone signal which you can put on the battery box. But you can change situation. For example, we activate here the power IO, power on, pay attention. Then, now, it is mean by default it is not work. Not input, not output energy, not charge, not discharge, nothing happened. But if you give redstone signal, for example, this lever, everything begin work. Uh, in another situation, if you choose redstone off, without redstone signal, it does not work at all. See? But if you activate redstone signal, it stop work. Easy. Totally the same story with item I.O. But before we use item I.O., we must configure the slots. Here's the By default, we have two slots, left slot and our, our right slot. And it is configuration not for energy, but for items. You can uh, automate work with box, automatically charge, uh, for example, different drills or something with hopper and so on. I want to show you example. It is more clear. Place hopper here. Then uh, uh, go in configuration. Then press right mouse button. I want, for example, suck items from the mm, top side. So uh, where is it? Wait a second, guys. Aha, uh -huh. dot here. So in our configuration, this uh, it is upper sl slide s uh, slot. So here we can press left mouse button. The blue one it is mean output input. It is mean uh, all items we which work from this hopper on above go here inside. If you choose green, it is output and input, and that's all. Now choose option uh, input. After that. If you place battery here, this battery go not in right slot, but in left slot. Easy? Easy. Then, uh, if we choose option, for example, not choose anything with output or input, 
how it is work. It is not work with hoppers at all. So it is not uh, work with hopper or any other tube or another logistic system from any other mods. By default, it is not work at all. You must properly set up because, you know, now, if you choose option right slot, press right mouse button and choose, for example, this slot for right slot. Now, if you place all items in the hopper, this item will go in not left slot, but in right slot. Easy? Easy. Then, I want to try something. So, I want to combine these items from the left slot. For example, in this situation, for left slot, press left mouse button. Here, choose green option. Now it is output. So it is mean if you place item in left slot, this item go in the hopper in this side. So that is the same story. Uh, I believe it is must work with. So it is work only with tubes, hoppers, and so on. It and it is not work with chest, for example, or with random inventory. It is harmful in my opinion. Anyway, awesome. Uh, uh, you can use item IO, for example, wizard stone on. Uh, and without a redstone signal, it does not work with items. For example, I try put here. Mm. Okay, now I charge and put. Yes. So with uh, item redstone on, it is uh, work only if we activate redstone. In this situation, it is can work with hopper. Ah. Okay, now if we choose option redstone off, it is work only with deactivated redstone. Okay, that's how the system works. Thank you for watching, like, comment, subscribe, videos on with you. A lot of other tutorials about Tech Reborn, which you can find in the video description section below. Also, advice. Uh, if you have a long wire on your base, a really long, for example, several hundreds or dozens blocks uh, every 10 or 50 blocks use as buffer better box it is help you because it is work with uh, buff, buff buffer prevent your item loss also it is very help you to in situation when you want repair or change x uh, uh, the your energy system and so on and so on in any other different situation believe me in the video description you find tons of other teacher reborns uh, 